I generally find that there's a direct correlation between the time I spend scrolling through Instagram and my level of dissatisfaction with my life, my body, the things I own, etc. Think of it this way, let's say if you take a photo, it captures one second out of your day. Well, there are 86,000 seconds in a day, meaning even if you posted one photo per day to Instagram, the fraction of your day that you're sharing on Instagram, it's such a small sliver that if this pie chart was drawn to scale, it wouldn't even show up. And what fraction of your day do you choose to show? Obviously, the awesome parts. Even celebrities, even the most beautiful people and Instagram stars in the world, if you plotted the events of their life on a bell curve, you'd find that the middle of the bell curve is super boring. Everyone else's life looks awesome on Instagram because they filter out the boring parts and then they add extra filters on the good parts to make them look even better. If you scroll through my camera roll, you'll find that the ratio of selfies I'll take before I'll actually post one is ridiculous and embarrassing. I'm not saying Instagram is bad. Some parts can make you really happy, like, I don't know, funny graphing videos. I'm just saying don't judge the quality of your life by comparing it to the lives you seem to be seeing on Instagram.